Welcome to my channel. My name is Nick Starchild, a lifestyle architect, but today I'm going to share a little bit about my journey here uh, to Mexico. So this first video is um, just a little bit about that journey, um, getting on those planes. So um, I first started very early in the morning, about like 536 get up, get ready to catch an Uber. Um, so uh, I'm in my room in this clip here. You see just my last look at my surroundings. This is my man cave, <laughs> uh, my man cave, um, uh, an office essentially. And um, uh, I took one uh, check luggage and one backpack carry on for this trip. Uh, and then uh, you can see me looking at my apartment. I was kind of saying goodbye. <laughs> it's the end of an era and uh, heading off to the airport. Last time in the United States for a very, very, very long time, hopefully. Cross my finger. This is an example of why I leave in the United States. This was $20, $19. So this is burrito. 19 Yeah, that burrito was $19. $19 for a burrito at the airport. This is Oakland International Airport. Uh, that's wild, right? Can you, like, 20 bucks for a burrito? A breakfast burrito? I am really excited to never spend that much money on a burrito again in my life. Uh, that's just, you know, that's barrier prices. That's, that's not all around the United States, but that's pretty typical in terms of like inflation and what I was dealing with and what I could not attend to anymore. Um, granted, um, I am keeping that apartment right now because it is affordable. Um, that, I, that I showed you a clip ago, the, the apartment that I have, it's a, it's pretty affordable. So it's going to be very, and it, I'm calling it my like very expensive storage unit uh, for now until I figure out uh, long-term plans. And if um, I'm going to come back and keep that apartment or if we're going to sell it, uh, not, you know, give it up and sell all the stuff inside. But I took all, um, I got rid of things I didn't need and I kept uh, the stuff that I wanted to. And yeah, we'll see how things go. Uh, now we'll just get into the next clip. Uh, so this is me on the fl first flight, uh, which was smooth. I went to Santa Ana. Uh, I took Southwest, by the way, and I went to Santa Ana uh, from Oakland. I had about a 45 minute layover and then got on my flight from Santa Ana uh, straight to Mexico. Um, I am in Puerto Vallarta. Um, and yeah, both flights were pretty smooth, no issues whatsoever. I really enjoyed it. I like Southwest. People give uh, Southwest a hard time, but I, I really enjoyed it. And um, I arrived, and then I do want to point out, I have this little section here you can see uh, about when you get to the airport and how, uh, where you want to go. So the thing is, is when you get off, there's going to be a whole bunch of people trying to get your attention, yelling at you, you know, trying to get you to take a taxi. It's really intense. It's so, it's really too much. You just ignore them. And then once you get out to the main um, part of the airport, you uh, follow those instructions and you will cross the street and then you can call an Uber. And then Uber is way more affordable than taking a taxi and getting ripped off because they're going to rip you off because they're like, oh, great, you're a foreigner. I'm going to overcharge you. So, uh, but yeah, that was the trip. Um, nothing too crazy to report. I got in fine and um, uh, it was a smooth transition to my Airbnb. Um, and I'll end the video with uh, a little reflection here. So yeah, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video with all of my other travels. Later. It's like, I don't even know what time it is, 9.30 maybe? And I went out for a little bit of a walk and uh, you know, it's nighttime and it was a little overwhelming. There's a lot of people on the main street. I was kind of surprised how busy it was. Uh, I didn't have any cash, so I just went to OXO and got some water, a bag of chips and two two big things of water, a bag of chips and some and a candy bar. And it was four bucks, so very cheap. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna order on Rappi because 
I just don't have the energy to like try to speak Spanish right now and I just I'm terrible at it and um uh, the places that take visa, I don't really want to eat at right now, so I'm just gonna order a burger and fries through this place that's around the corner, but I'm having it delivered, so I just don't have to speak Spanish today. It is a long day, so I'm giving myself some grace and start tomorrow, because, yeah, tomorrow's a, it's a new day, so we'll see how it goes. Um, I'm feeling good. I'm just very tired from this excursion, so I've been, uh, I've been traveling since... 7:45 a.m. So it's been over 12 hours. So I'm really tired. I need to relax and just get my bearings.